Hello and welcome to today's Pirate Japan Horde playthrough. <laughs> These names are getting a bit too long. Uh, <laughs> just come from my Hoi 4 recording session. I also did that today. And yeah, they also named way too long there. And yeah, we had a naval build up because we wanted to challenge the Europeans. A thing that I noticed is that we can rival them, but uh, I feel like both wars are about taking the capital cities. I can test it out. Let's find out. Bum, rival Spain. Wait a month. Bum, now we should have gotten a war goal. Right click and humiliate. Take Madrid. Yep, it is both about capital city. I don't like that, so we'll try to claim what they have. The problem is, where can I claim them? I mean, having a spy network is nothing bad, but I don't really see where this could be, but it's like between. Th mm, could be they have to attack someone else to get what I want from them, right? So what could I attack that is close to them? I guess. Give me something against them. And yeah, by the way, I, I saw in between episodes, this wonder here is looking really, really good for colonialization. It has no religion you need, so it would just be a straight up plus 25 bonus in uh, global settler increase for yeah, just just because, right? Um, it's really strong. Uh, can I do this? It would drag in this OPM up here. It's not an OPM, but not strong. I would say this would be a good war. Right, how big are you? Not really, so it's just about Malacca. And then we could get all of this. The bully them out. I co belligerate them so I can actually take some stuff. Yeah, I would say this is a good war. How about it? And we yeah, should have the navy to fight them, no problem. Good. Speed four. I'm gonna send my armed forces here. I'm gonna land there. And we take this out. We also have some rebels that might be rising up any second now, but I can get a second army for that, no problem just land and then take you out we could actually make a marine army at some point not gonna lie it would be kind of intelligent i would say so you go here good i would say that's fine nice good then i will take these and you stay in port while yep that's not stupid you get a new leader fun actually a good leader and you go over there because we're about to have an uprising there I totally didn't think about Malacca having that. <laughs> I forgot about that. Uh, I guess you will land over there then. Yeah, you will absolutely land over there then. Like at the end here. You should be technology-wise way ahead. Like three technologies ahead. So as soon as we touch the army, they should just die. They actually cut me off last second. It's actually... Wow. I'm, I'm, I'm positively surprised. Really annoying. Like good for the eye. Uh, that's good. Yeah, I didn't choose a new idea group yet, because um, I want to give you a chance to mention one in the comments. I don't force you to do so, but I do want to give you more interaction again, because I feel like it has come short in the last few playthroughs. Yeah, see, we're just melting them. They didn't got stacked quite, but that was really, really hurting them. So, but I really need this army over here, now they're about to rise up. Good. Continue converting, that's fine. Um, taking for edicts. I feel like you all converted, so we don't need you. Bam. Any other edicts I've currently going? No. But I could use one over here for conversion. What am I currently converting, honestly? I actually don't 100% know for sure. Oh, you. Ah. Wait, no. You. I'm, I'm so stupid. Uh, you're not even statified. Okay, let's change that. So I don't mind having the states done here. A little bit over limit now, but it should kind of get resolved very soon. I will not unseach this, I will just siege more. It's not that important. And are you core? You're not even core land, so it doesn't matter. So yeah. That's fine. It's better off to just get rid of his local army there. Good. The army's being transported over. Yeah, I'm doing all of this just to get a claim on the one island so I can get some war score. I'm gonna be honest, I did a test run. <laughs> Uh, kind of happy that I do saves now. I want to be like open on this episode, right? I did a test run where I did this war and it was very caught off guard that humiliation wars need to be uh, our capital war. This is why I double checked it at the beginning of the episode um, that they involve capital cities needing to be taken, right? Because I'm so sure they're about winning battles. But I might just be thinking about crusades here. But I thought they, 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 they were falling in the same category of being a war goal, um, being winning battles. 
I just might have said wrong in my head because I don't do humiliation wars that often. But at the same time, for me, this is a huge Mandela effect where I even said it many times in my streams and no one corrected me. And there are only sitting experts in my streams, trust me. They have a lot of things to say about this game if I say something slightly off. So I'm actually... I feel like I... <laughs> I don't know. Please correct me if I'm wrong here in the comments. Uh, I'm just shocked to learn about this. Um, that's all fine. Good. Re-elect. Hope he doesn't die immediately. Treasure fleet. We actually got a treasure fleet now. That's fun. From where? Oh, we stole from a treasure fleet. Oh, that's funnier. Yeah. Good. That's all fine. Nice. Okay, we're about to take this. Then we can take out all of that. Um, this has been unseed trip to second army. Let's go over there. And then I should I should take my navy over here. I don't know why I don't do this. Take this island. And then take the rest. Good. Merge you. Take you over there. You go over there. Free stability. Oh my god. I didn't even look. I just took an event. I see an event with one choice. I'm like, yeah, click it. I, it's not, I can click anything else. But I should have done it. I could have done more if they want uh, one stability. I could have gone up to three now for no problem. Uh, so remove this now. Put this here for faster conversion. The religious ideas might be something we could use. But on the other hand, I'm also a big fan. Wait, 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 wait. Did just lose a naval battle? What was that? I don't see battle lock, so I actually don't know, but I feel like... Well, that's a large amount of this Portuguese here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, but my ships are better. Don't forget that. My ships are definitely better than theirs, but um, they shouldn't underestimate the Spanish and the Portuguese because they will be fighting together because they are allied. Um, I don't think they will send a lot, uh, but I do think that we should win. Uh, we should prepare Navy-wise, right? Because if you can just catch everything they have, should be no problem. Should be an easy war. Uh, you are at war with me. Okay, that's fine. There is there are a navy, so I should kind of try to take out that. For some nice navy XP. I don't need that bonus. I really don't. Okay, let's see how this goes. They are melting. Good. I even gained a few ships from this. <laughs> ah, yes. Um, I feel like Malaysia really tried to, or Malacca tried really to take out all of this. And now we are here and kind of bullying them. I feel like I can take a good chunk of the trade ports. Because I had... Uh, item core belligerated. So this should be doable. Where else do we have trade ports in this region? None here. Have one here. I have none here. This is a trade port. But for that, we have to take the fort. But my army is right next to it, so I could actually be able to just take it. Yeah, just land there. How angry would people be? I'm angry enough. Just go through here. It is shorter. Yes, it's not colonialized, but does it really need to be? You're a strong army. You will survive this. Good. Um, this is all looking very fine, I'm gonna be honest. Big fan of where this expansion is going. We, I know we're doing all of this just to fight the Europeans in the long run. Kind of push them out of here. But on the other way, it gives us trade power. And I also want to build up a trade empire, so I don't mind. But to really have a trade empire, I need to have a lot of control over uh, Malacca. Because it is a good end trade node. I can get all the profits from here into there. But everything down here, I can't get up here, which is a big problem. The downside is that I actually need full control, right? Otherwise, the, the Europeans will come over and will try to steal my trade. This is very profitable over here, and they are just one trade node away from ciphering it out. Uh, but yes, I will try to protect it as good as I can. And the Spanish are surrounded the vault. Sweats. Good. You will give me my demands now, right? Yes, you will. Great. I'm very popular now. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. So, can go over there. Or is some um, career actually in a coalition now? 
Yeah, I feel like I have to declare the next... Will Shun join this? Probably. But I kind of doubt they will declare. It's a lot of small powers uh, joining a coalition, you're right. Uh, they would join. Would you join the coalition? You would. I guess I could do this to just kind of get them out of this war against the world thing is basically free. Join a coalition yet? Nope, they didn't. And my army is strong enough so they can handle this. Okay. Declare on you next month if you're not in the coalition just to kind of shock them. I, I just don't want the coalition to be able to be big enough to be actually some... to actually attack me, right? I don't mind having a coalition luring around. I just don't want a really active coalition doing anything. That's actually annoying. Good. Uh, you can go into here now, and I really do need manpower, so maybe chill. But like the European war is not really... Yeah, for that, we're not allowed to have a coalition, especially some nation like Shun would be annoying. Uh, you are... You're in the coalition, so this would put you out of the coalition. Actually good. Just need some kind of peace tree. I don't even need to take land. I just want to get him out of there. Suck up all of the armies and should be fine. Right, kind of deny him any kind of build up and this is an easy one war. Good, we're now landing in here, which should allow me to be strong and get claims on the Spanish over there. This is actually why we're doing this. <laughs> uh, that would be nice. Beautiful. Anyone else I'm at war? These islands, you down here. Yeah, I will mostly demand money from them, honestly. The really downside of this is that I can't raid them for a while. That is a real downside, in my opinion. But that's the only real downside I see in this. Then, oh, yeah, good. Siege, uh, good ship bonuses, I'm gonna be honest. Yes, give me trade power. And we can go speed 5, I see no problem with that. Uh, I can put you over there. I c you can go now into here and take out this. Ah, oh, yeah, this ally still exists. But yeah, we have so much we have so much chooses after that. Uh, if I just attack Wu in time, I should have no problem. There'll be a bigger war, though. So yeah, I, I, I kind of drag out the war of the Europeans. I am so sorry, but I feel like if I don't do this, I will just deal with coalitions that can really just be avoided. Um, so, your prestige will get it back faster, doesn't matter. Oh yeah, let's do this. <laughs> I'm with War of them, so I can do this. Siege down. Then... Go together again. Bum. This also gives me, like, naval stuff. Like, uh, naval experience? Not what this one was called. Tradition. Navy tradition. There you go. Keep him... Hey, as long as we can. Keep him around. He's 45. He could actually live a lot longer. And we'll see if he actually does. But, yeah. I mean, yeah, that was a little bit of a greedy expansion down there, but I feel like it would have been a shame to not get anything out of this. <laughs> uh, so, uh, yep. I did. I, I was greedy and I did take. It's actually a goldman over here, as much as I remember. Yeah, it is. Will I take it? I'm not sure. If it doesn't grow the coalition, yes, but if, if it does, I, I'm not. We'll take these two. I just want something boring to the Spanish. Good. Thank you for being stack wiped. What is the technology of Shun? 14, I'm 15. I'm only one ahead, but I feel like because they are the Emperor of China, they're currently not strong. They're really struggling because they own none of the... Like, they control none of this down here. They're trying. They're really trying. I say that much. Yeah, they try to take some of it. But I feel like with the devastation I do to their land, they're actually struggling. So, um, talking about the devastation I do, let me just read the coast to be a real dick about it. Uh, so they're really struggling to keep all of this. Yeah. <laughs> uh, devastation minus. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm just saying, as long as I do this, he will never have good um, mandate and his armies will perform poorly. And he knows that, so he's not a real danger, right? Uh, bum, 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 bum. It's not, no one, no one new joins. How much can I take here? No one new joins. And... Is that they shouldn't join? Shouldn't already in this. Who joins? Um, the one who's already in, right? I feel like no one new joins. Let's take all of this. Uh, I'm greedy. I don't care. 
good. Uh, we build up our own small little trade empire over here with gold and everything. And I will try to kind of convert this to my religion and everything. So maybe I actually go down the religious idea path. But I feel like for me, empire building wise, administrative ideas would be better. Um, I can always get advices for religion and stuff like that. And religion, I can convert it over time and decrease. And the, the other thing, governing capacity is harder to kind of get with money. Uh, I'm just gonna say that. I mean, I can build a lot of... I can't build them yet. Town halls and... Also, you're right. Where is it called? State houses. They're also really good. I mean, I could build like a few of them already, right? They're actually really, really good. I don't give them as much courage as they deserve. Good. You go down. Oh, I just noticed a rebellion. I am so sorry. So this is mostly Sunni I'm fighting down here, right? Yeah, so the Sunnis are mostly angry about me quote-unquote expanding down here. I should take them out, by the way. So... You don't own trade port. There's no trade port here. This is also only an island. If I take anything, they would be mad. Uh, no one you gets at it. Like, again, why? Why should I not take everything? Right? Why, why shouldn't I? Why shouldn't I just take this? It is not that big of a deal, apparently. Oh, yeah, I forgot I'm a horde. I'm so stupid. I am so... Okay, it, it, you know what? I can still undo this. Race. Good, 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 good. Okay, I've redeemed myself, I hope. Because I haven't caught any of this, really. I haven't caught you at all. Good, 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 good. Some of you must have been screaming in the comments, and I'm not even mad about it. Yeah, I can't undo that siege. Anything else I took? Not really. On that gold mine. You're being settled. That's fine. I guess. Yeah, I'm so sorry for getting about that. I'm honestly sorry. Uh, it's like our biggest ability and I'm just not using it. Ay, 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 ay. I'm just happy that this is not too highly deaf and I didn't take too much land. So it's not that horrendous. It's mostly trade ports I just took. But still, right? It was, it was stupid. Uh, wait, you've been on the ships on a while. You're just dying of attrition here. What, why are you doing this? So you land here. Good. This, I just need a decent army. Oh, you are here. Good, good, good. I feel like you're decent enough to land over here, right? Technology difference. Of, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It is absolutely fine. Ming separatists have crossed our borders. Are they going to stay in my land? They are. They go to the next trade port just to be annoying. Amazing, thank you. Yeah, they continue to lose mana as long as I'm just annoying. That is good to know. Okay, that means my truce is all with them. No, not yet. Oh, I'm raiding them. Okay, good, good, good. Don't forget that we can't have a truce forever with them. Good, you landed here. That is amazing. You all merged up. Good. Repair you. Because I need you in good shape, like always. Then let's claim this. So we don't forget about it. Uh, we can't call you just yet. I like that we're taking over forts. Because that does mean that we are stronger in the long run. I will bring one army already over. Deal with the rebels and for the next war. Uh, mainly because... Wait, population, parity, efficiency, parity, efficiency. Yeah, give me parity, efficiency. I'm do, I do be parityering now. Because then we can already attack whenever we want, right? And it could be that my spy has been found and, you know, uh, it decreases again the spy network. Which happened. Which happened before, right? So, yeah. By the way, tomorrow... For the people, for the Hearts of Iron 4 enjoys, uh, that will be the conclusion of the episode, which I, oh, episode of the series of the EU run. And I made it a bit special. So if you like that, you will appreciate that one. If you didn't check out the series because it's not yours, trust me, I'm not mad. Uh, I just like playing different games. And the EU4 is going to be the, EU4 is going to be a main thing on this channel, right? Just to be saying, for the people who are scared, oh, other stuff is coming. Yes, other stuff will come. I'm not just an EU4 content creator. And this Let's Play channel is my hobby, so I do whatever I want. I've got to be rude. I do whatever I want at the end of the day. 
But I do listen to you because you have great ideas. I'm going to be honest. A lot of ideas from the comments I've been putting into this let's play. And at the same time, and a lot of them are just fun to read. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> and also, um, I do like don't want to burn out on the game right like if i only make eo4 content there will be the point where i feel like okay i have to force myself to play eo4 again i sometimes already have that honestly right uh but it's not really bad yet it's just literally okay i don't want to play eo4 today but i don't want to reach it to point like oh I, I see this game and i i have like a hate like i don't i don't, don't want to reach that point i just like my variety life i like to do something of this something of this so yeah there's a lot you can do in this game, right? But I don't want to burn out on it. This is why I switch it up. Uh, people of you, like some of you said already Civilization 5. I agree. Good game. I will check it out. Was it Civil... No, wait. Civilization 6, right? So that's the new thing, right? The new Civilization, right? <laughs> and I'm, I'm mixing them all up. And I... I'm in for that. I'm in for that. I already thought about a main channel video where I play with Zero and some other people in MP. So if you want to join that, feel free. This is, will be in months from now or maybe weeks, I can't say, but not tomorrow. So don't be scared. So if you're interested, once again, we have a multiplayer role in my channel. Nothing is automated. So if you want to just write me, it's nothing too special. And you will be added to the multiplayer chat. If I... Please write me on the Discord though, because I will not check my comments. We lost a lot of troops for that uprising. Um... <laughs> I don't worry, I always want to go with Discord, uh, YouTube, Discord, YouTube, just just write it, just write it in, in the Discord, thank you. If you don't want to join the Discord, it's absolutely fine, right? I, I will hate on no one who's just not on Discord. Um, I also talk, I, I also like to talk through comments, right? No problem, right? So, I didn't call belligerate them, but I can take the trade port and a little bit more. So, I will erase that, I will erase that, and I will erase that. I will use these points to core. Amazing. Good, I feel like I'm in a scary position. How is my professionalism looking? Uh, very bad, so I could just get mercs. Doesn't matter. They're busy with Shun, though. Oh, and they already joined the coalition when I didn't look. Okay. But me seeing that they're all fighting each other, I doubt they will attack me. I, I, I'm, I have so many truces down here and so many truces up there. And their A will tick down in the next few years, so I don't need to attack them right now, actually would care about this no one no one really just the region the region really hates me so i could just take all of this just to connect the land i didn't even want to take anything i just want to stop uh, coalitions but at the same time in a weird irony taking over a nation removes that nation from a potential coalition okay i'm just saying they're becoming an uprising problem but that's in the category internal problems okay that's easier to handle <laughs> So maybe I can focus on the Europeans next episode. Talking about next episode, thank you for watching so far. <laughs> oh, I spent two hours on the last Hoi 4 episode. So yes, I've got to keep it short now. Uh, uh, until next time, love you all. Bye.